Welcome back to the Okie Smoking channel. My name is John and today we're going to be using the best of both worlds. So you've seen in videos I do the Blackstone, I do the Pit Barrel. We're going to be using both for this. It's beer, cheese, pizza. And all we're going to do is go ahead and start out with a little butter. Cooking it on the Blackstone in a cast iron skillet. Of course, any pan will do. We're just gonna go ahead and melt this butter, have this burner on high over here. While that starts to melt, I wanna caramelize some onions up for this pizza. So let me get this off. And we're just gonna throw that in there. So I'm gonna let this cook for a good while, 15 plus minutes to really caramelize this onion. And while that caramelizes up real nicely, I'm just gonna show you, we just have a basic pizza crust. Now I got this at Winco, where they already have the pizza pre-made and I wrote it out with a little flour, put it on a pizza pan with a little oil underneath to try to prevent it from sticking. And then we're gonna make the beer cheese sauce in the cast iron skillet and then we're going to be putting it on here and finish it off by throwing it in the pit barrel right on those grates here shortly uh, this doesn't require pre-baking but you can use whatever crust you want and um, kind of get your crust ready and then the sauce and everything hopefully comes together i'll show you a little bit of what all we got This is cheddar jack cheese. So we'll be adding that to the beer cheese sauce here shortly. We got some butter. We also got some, uh, there is bacon in here, about a half a pound of bacon and about a half a pound of some Italian sausage in this one that we're gonna be adding to it here in a bit. Also got a little heavy, a heavy whipping cream. And it is cold outside right now, about. 40 degrees, so all the ingredients are fine just sitting out here. It's like I'm in a refrigerator. Then we've got a couple of tablespoons of butter we'll be adding here in a bit, and a little bit of garlic as well. So we'll be putting all these ingredients together, putting it all on this pizza back here, and throwing it on that pit barrel. You may say, why am I cooking the onions in here? rather than on here, and that's a good question, and I could have, and you can cook the onions directly on your Blackstone, uh, but we're gonna be putting the beer cheese sauce in here, and of course it would pour out, and we kinda want to cook the bacon in here and the sausage in here, and all the flavors, get some flavorness uh, to all of the ingredients while we cook this, so that's why I'm doing that. But one of the advantages of the Blackstone is I can actually go ahead and transfer it over here and let it continue to cook. So it's been cooking in here for a while. It's starting to glaze up. You can see, I would like it to glaze a little more, and you can do it all in here. But so we can multitask just a little bit. I'm just going to add a little olive oil over here. I have this uh, burner now on medium. And we're going to transfer. The onions right over here. Leave a little in there, that's fine, good for flavor. And we'll just let those continue to cook right there. Then I'm just gonna go ahead, I've, I've chopped up about a half a pound of bacon. We're gonna cook it till it's completely done now. Again, you can cook it on the Blackstone, but by cooking it in here, you're gonna get some of that bacon flavor you know, once we start to make the beer cheese sauce. So we want it all cooked in here, at least a little while. And if you really wanna take it up a notch, let's cook that on the pit barrel just a second.
Take your cast iron. Really make this ever how you want. We're going to cook that in the pit barrel for about three or four minutes, maybe five minutes. Stir it a little, throw it back on here, throw it on onto the blackstone, and then add the sausage. Do the same thing, and we're going to have our toppings done that's going on this pizza. So we're going to transfer it back over to the blackstone. And it's starting to come together real nice. You don't even need this. You could cook this entire dish right here in the pit barrel. Just get you a skillet. And you could do it all right there. So I've got the flavors mending here. We're going to throw this right here now. Let it continue to brown. You can hear a little more sizzle as it's directly on the black stone. And we're going to do the Italian sausage. I think it's time to start the beer cheese sauce. So the sausage is, it's almost done. We're going to go ahead and put it on here, let it continue cooking with the other toppings. Does get a little hotter on there. It'll cook a little more. So, what we're going to do now is start the beer cheese sauce. So this is the fun part. And when you do this recipe, you could actually just cook the bacon on here, the sausage on here, and go ahead and start your beer cheese sauce all at once. I might do another video on that, but we're going to do it right now by adding a couple tablespoons of butter let that melt then after I've got that butter melted I've got about three cloves two and a half three cloves put this in here I've got about a half a teaspoon of um, paprika salt and a ground mustard, I almost forgot. Half a teaspoon of salt, ground mustard, and paprika in here. We're gonna just throw that in there and mix that all up in here and get some good flavors going on. Look at that. Woo, you can smell it, it smells good. Starting to see that brown a little. Let's go ahead and add a couple of tablespoons of flour. There's two or three of them. I'm just gonna go ahead and mix that in here and let that brown up. So now we're just going to go ahead and add this in. This is, I figure for the Oki Smoking Channel, we need an Oki beer. This is the Saturday Siren. It's an IPA. And we're going to put a full can in here. I'm just going to let that flour, kind of want to cook that flour a minute at least. A minute or two. Then just slowly. Don't want to pour it all in at once. I want to kind of pour it in, mix it, pour it in, mix it. Patience. Starting to, look at that. So I want to cook this for just a little bit until it starts to almost boil. Then we're going to add the heavy cream, heavy whipping cream in. Go ahead and let it boil, boil on up, and then we'll simmer it. So you're watching the Oki Smoking Channel on YouTube, and that's what this is about. Cooking on the Blackstone, cooking on the pit barrel. If you enjoy the outdoor content, be sure and subscribe. But I've got to say, this would work with only the pit barrel if you wanted to. 
You could cook all this in the pit barrel right on this skillet. You could also cook all of your side items or your toppings directly on here and just skip the skillet. But I wanted to do it to just kind of add some flavor. Just know when you cook in here, it takes a little longer for it to heat up. Uh, so we did kind of use this um, to kind of get everything cooked a little quicker. So now we just got to wait for this thing to start heating up here. And I can see, ooh, a little splash, starting to stir it up here. It is starting to heat up that beer sauce, the beginning of the beer cheese sauce. This is also great. You could just make this sauce and use it as a dip, uh, but we're going to turn it into pizza today. It's been heating up for about five minutes. I'm going to go ahead and add the heavy whipping cream. So we've been boiling for about a solid three to five minutes, maybe even a little longer, and you can see it's thickening up. We lost the other cameras because of some battery, battery shortage, so we'll do it this way. But you can see that's starting to thicken up just a little bit. So what we're going to do now is just add about a cup and a half of Cheddar Jack cheese, uh, split 50-50 or you could just get it in a cheddar jack blend like that. Now I'm just gonna let this melt real good, kinda get this real cheesy, and then we're just gonna set it aside. You can see over here, we've kinda got everything mixed up, all our toppings, which is fine because this is all gonna just go on a pizza. It's starting to look like it's gonna be really good. It's about time to build the pizza too. So just mix this all up. Look at that, look at that, that's just, whoo, boy, look at that, yeah. All right. Turn these off. And we're just gonna start letting this set for just a minute, and then I'm gonna get a, um, whoo, look at that, gosh, that cheese stringy. And then uh, let's go ahead and build the pizza. So I've got the uh, pizza sauce, which is really thickened up. And you can let it set a little bit, try to thicken up to your liking. But I'm just gonna go ahead and I think we're gonna try this now. So here's the pizza, we're just gonna. This is the beer cheese pizza and it looks nice on there. So we're just gonna put the toppings. So look at that, just what? The beer cheese pizza covered in all them toppings we cooked on here. And we're gonna throw it right into the black, or the, uh, the pit barrel right here. So now we're just gonna let that cook for about uh, 20, 20 or so minutes, and we're gonna see how this tastes. So here it is, beer, cheese, bacon, pizza with a little Italian sausage. It was cooked, smoked on the pit barrel for about 20 minutes, and then I cooked it an extra five minutes with the lid partially open for a little added heat. And that's how it came out, about 25 minutes total. And it smells amazing. Mm. Man, that is amazing, I love it. You've gotta try this. The caramelized onions, the bacon, it all just goes so well. You'll love it. Smoked on the pit barrel. This tastes great. Be sure and give it a try and be sure and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video.